A unique marriage took place in Korea on Friday. It wasn't between two people, but rather two buildings. The ceremony commemorated Gyeongju City's royal past and marks the end of the Silk Road Cultural Festival. Guan Zheng Ho has more. This is the Gyeongju Tower. It was built in 2007 and represents the Hwangyongsa Temple Tower that stood at the location over a thousand years ago. And now meet its new husband, the Jungdo Tower. Completed earlier this year, just a stone's throw away from its wife, it is a replica of the Hwangyongsa Tower recreated from the designs left in ancient records. The Hwangyongsa Temple was the jewel of the Shilla Kingdom when it was built in the 7th century. At the time, the main nine-storey tower was the tallest structure in Asia, standing at 263 feet. The temple and its tower stood for almost 600 years before it was destroyed by Mongolian invaders in the 13th century. Now the two modern towers, commemorating the temple and Gyeongju city's royal past, have been married to symbolize the hope of unification of Korea. Much like when Queen Sundok built Hwangyongsa Tower dreaming of world peace, the union of the two towers represents the hope for a peaceful and united Korea. Hundreds of Gyeongju residents came out for the lavish ceremony, which was held in front of the bride. It's hoped the newlyweds will have a long and happy marriage. Kwon Jang-ho, Arirang News.